Yo, what is going on, you guys? It's your boy, Daniel Killer, back at it again with another video on the channel, guys. Today, we are going to be going ahead, or what? We're going to be going ahead and talking about something that has been going around a lot in the Call of Duty community. So, you guys can already tell by the title what we're talking about. We're talking about Call of Duty Black Ops 2. The mo- probably my- this- that's- <sighs> Call of Duty Black Ops 2 is actually my favorite game out of all time. It's just such a balanced and it's such a great game. And, you know, I honestly cannot think of another game that- it's just- I don't under- I don't understand it. It's just- even though I'm really bad at, you know, the multiplayer, I'm just- I enjoy the zombies like so much like the zombies are just amazing I mean honestly the only map I really like on there is origins but to be honest they've done a super great you know super great job on black ops 2 and today I'm gonna give my opinion on the backwards compatible and the um, the little remastered thing so let's get started. So a lot of people. So let's get started with this. So a lot of people have been talking about, or there's a lot of things have been out on um, the uh, the backwards compatible things on Xbox, like the videos. And there's a tiny little tiny little teaser showing Black Ops 2 for the backwards compatible list. And let's just let's just talk about that. So let me give my opinion on if there should be remastered. Or there should be backwards compatible. Now, to be honest, for for the people who have originally played Black or uh, uh, the uh, Xbox 360 and have all the DLCs on there, I would love to see it backwards compatible. Like it would be amazing to have Black uh, Black Ops 2 backwards compatible to the Xbox One, and it would just honestly honestly be amazing. But also, I honestly would enjoy the hell out of a Black Ops 2 remastered. Like Black Ops 2 Remastered. Imagine seeing multiplayer and zombies remastered, but <laughs> I chance it. Oh my god, bro. The only map I would actually play though is Mob of the Dead and Origins. But I think Mob of the Dead and Origins would look the best, honestly. And I don't even know what to say. I honestly think that backwards compatible because like I don't feel like buying a new game and I mean, obviously, I would do it, but I don't want to, like, keep buying the new DLCs and just... Oh, such a pain in the butt. But, honestly, I really would enjoy to, s to see both of them. But I'd rather go for the backwards compatible than the remastered. Obviously, I would love the remastered, but, you know... Oh. Oh, my God. I just got a notification. I thought uh, the new map was out for uh, Black Ops... Or, uh, Infinite Warfare. But anyway, whatever you think about this, I honestly don't think any other game could top Black Ops 2 because it's one is super balanced, two it's just fun to play, three it's basically a next gen console or next gen game on an older console, and you know it's just too balanced, too balanced to not be backwards compatible or remastered. Now I don't think they should remaster it. I think they, uh, I mean, I mean, see, I, as I said, I'd love to see it, but they should just keep it how it is. Be I mean, obviously, they could do the same exact thing they could, did, but maybe they would do something else, like add Excel suits, but, so, but the only thing, that, there's a problem. Activision likes their money, <laughs> you know? Activision loves their money, and let's talk profit. Which one do you think they would go for? Do you think they would go for a backwards compatible to where people can just get their DLCs be uh, for free, you know, from the older consoles? Or make a new remastered game, have them have to buy the game and the DLCs and add supply drops? <laughs> I think that's honestly what they would do with Black Ops 2. Is try to make the exact same, but remaster it, obviously. New textures, new everything. But, add supply drops. 
And I honestly think that if they actually did have supply drops in Black Ops 2, it would honestly be amazing. Like, anything with supply drops, like, hearing Black Ops 2 plus supply drops, I mean, honestly, it doesn't sound the best, but it sounds a good idea, because, for them, at least, for their profits, because that's all they care about is profits. And, you know, I think, that honestly, that a lot of people would actually do it, you know, like, buy everything. So, they would probably go for the remastered. So, even if they were going to go ahead and backwards compatible it, uh, make it backwards compatible, they would probably not, like, announce anything. Or they would probably not make it backwards compatible. Or they, they not announce anything. Just make it, boop, surprise. Or they would not say anything at, at all about any backwards compatible and just make it remastered so you can play on PS4 and Xbox One. So, honestly, I think that... They should just go with the backwards compatible, because I'm honestly so sick of uh, having to, you know, log on and off of uh, my friend's account just to play it. It's just, oh, it's just so annoying. But, you know, to be honest, that's just my honest opinion on it. I honestly think that backwards compatible would be a little better, because a lot more players would actually play on it, and possibly, you know, they would get more money because... Hey, it's a new 360 game on Xbox One. Hey, it's pretty good. You know? Like, why not do that? I mean, I don't know. But it's up to you guys. It's up to them. You know, whatever they want to do. Uh, I can't say anything about it. But that's just my honest opinion. And also, Black Ops 2 has gotten the most amount of votes out of any Black Wars compatible games. And that's just crazy. And they haven't given, given us that. So, they're probably going to go ahead and copy, you know, whatever Infinity Ward did. And, uh, make a, back, uh, make a new game plus, you know, that, that little bundle. But, yeah, guys, if you guys did like this little rant that I just did, um, or if you guys want to see more, please smack the like button and go in the comment section below and tell me what you guys want me to talk about next or do what, uh, what to record next. And, um, yeah, that's all I have to talk about. So, thank you guys so much for watching. Please smack that like button if you go for 10 likes. And, yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. And, peace out. Check out the link description below. And, thank you to whoever I choose for a free gameplay. Alright. See you guys.